Bonjour, c'est Claire of French in the Midlands. Hello, Claire of French in the Midlands here. In today's video, I'm going to attempt to make a complex subject as simple as possible. It's about the difference between tout and tous and whether you should say the S of tous or not. I'll explain in a minute. Let's have a look. First of all, let's use tout. Tout, T-O-U-T, means everything or all. For example, j'entends tout, I can hear everything. In French we say, I hear everything, not I can hear. Bear that in mind. Tout n'est pas perdu, all is not lost. Again, tout, T-O-U-T, and you don't say the T. When it means everything, to never changes its spelling. It doesn't change whether it's feminine, masculine. It means everything. It doesn't mean one object in particular. So you leave it in the default masculine. This, on the other hand, is where it gets a bit more complex. Tu versus tut. Tus versus tut. So, first of all, they all mean the same. All of or the whole. For instance, il a mangé tout le gâteau. He ate all the cake. The meaning is the whole cake. All of the cake, if you like. Of course, when you put that to in the feminine, then you add the E. Le chat dort toute la journée. The cat sleeps all day long. So then to becomes tout because there's an E on the end. Okay, so far, how about when there's more than one? Then it becomes tous, but you don't say the S, we say tout. J'ai tué tous les moustiques. I killed all the mosquitoes. Now, if you want to say I killed them all, so the word mosquito is no longer there, je les ai tous tués, then that will be fine, you say the S. You only say the S when the noun is no longer there. And then, of course, when it's feminine, more than one, T-O-U-T-E-S, tout. So, toutes les filles sont en classe. All the girls are in class. So, in that case, as, as you've just noticed, two will change with feminine and plural. It's got another meaning as well of every and any. If you say, je fais du sport tous les jours, it means I play sport every day. It's kind of a set expression, tous les jours. Toute action a des conséquences. Any action has consequences, or every action has consequences, whichever they're interchangeable. So you see how it works. Tous les jours, toute Action, because action is a feminine word. So again, in this case, two will change with feminine and plural. And that's about it. You will probably need to listen to this one several times because it's quite, it's a bit tricky to get, but you should be okay after two or three times you've watched it. I shall see you in the next video. Subscribe to my channel, leave a comment below and check frenchinthemidlands.com for more ebooks and videos. A bientôt!